Fabric rosettes are a lovely addition to wearable art projects. You can create necklaces, brooches, hair accessories, and much more. For my necklace, I decided to create three roses. It's best to cut the fabric into different lengths so that you have a longer strip for the middle rose so that it's the largest, and then two smaller strips for the other two roses. If you were creating a necklace with five or seven roses, you would cut smaller strips for the roses accordingly. To create the rose, take a long strip and fold it in half then tie a knot at one end. The flat part of the knot is where you will begin the wrap. This will be the center of the rose. Gradually wrap the fabric around the knot, twisting the fabric up as you go. This will create the look of the petals inside the rose and give it a nice tattered appearance because one edge is the folded side and the other is the cut side with a more raw appearance. Use one hand to hold the rose and keep it together and the other hand to wrap. Once the rose is complete, you will secure it at the back by stitching it a few times. Stitch across the bottom of the rose, stitching through as many of the layers as possible to help secure it. Once you have finished stitching, just cut off any excess fabric as needed. Then you will just secure the end of the knot by tying it. Once your three roses are complete, you're going to glue them onto a piece of felt. You can create a template for the number of roses you are using or alternatively just glue them straight onto the felt and then cut around them. You will leave a small space on either end open because this is where you will add the chain. Stitch the end loops of each piece of chain onto the backs of the roses in between the rose and the felt. The length of the chain will depend on how long you want the necklace. Once you have stitched the chain on, you're going to secure it by adding a drop of hot glue on the chain loop that you stitch and then secure the felt over it. Using your pliers, open up two chain links on one side of the necklace and attach the soaring swallow pendant and then secure the links closed. Attach a clasp of your choice from the class sampler pack to the necklace. The jewelry finding products used in this creative how-to video are available at the shop at Somerset. You can also visit the shop at Somerset to purchase a ready-to-go fabric rosette necklace kit.